Man. This is the boss right here. Apple cider vinegar. When I decided to become the CEO of my health, apple cider vinegar was one of the, the go-to for like everything for me, everything. If I had, you know, felt a sniffle, apple cider vinegar, like pretty much, it was just freaking amazing what it did for me. Now, a lot of people may say apple cider vinegar isn't good for you because it's acidic and it's this, and I beg to defer. What it does for me and all the changes that I've seen and for most people that I've recommended it to, it's done wonderful things. I love, love apple cider vinegar. My son knows that whenever he starts to sniffle, if you can't find the apple cider vinegar in the pantry, it's in his bedroom. And within a day, I swear to swear, all right? Within a day, the sniffles and everything is just, he's well. Whatever looked like it was allergies, you know, whatever was happening, going on inside of his body, it was, it was gone within a day, like literally less than 24 hours. He was up and running and feeling like his normal self. So I love apple cider vinegar. I use it in my salad sometimes, but for me, I just gulp it down. Oop, a tablespoon and I'm good to go. I used to take it like three times a day, but I noticed that it suppressed my appetite. I don't want to suppress my appetite. I like to eat. Yes, I like to eat. I don't want to suppress my appetite. So um, apple cider once a day for me and uh, I'm good to go. Um, but if you're trying to lose weight, it's great. And for most people, they might, um, the, the, the ones that I realize have a problem with apple cider vinegar that says, oh, it burns, it makes it worse for me when I swallow it. I find that it's people that have gut health issues. The ones that are, um, if they have ulcers or um, what do you call it? Ulcers, H. pylori, um, the ones that have gut health issues are the ones that can't really tolerate apple cider vinegar. Uh, acid reflux, GERD, those are the ones that I've noticed that's not a, because they already have gut issues. Their hydrochloric acid is low and I don't know what it does, but if it bothers you, there's so many other things that you can actually, um, um, use instead of the apple cider vinegar. But if not, I honestly do recommend apple cider vinegar and you want to get the apple cider vinegar with the mother in it. Yes, apple cider vinegar with the mother. All right, so that's where the healing enzymes are. Apple cider vinegar is boss. I love it, I love it, I love it. You can use it as a toner on your face. I mean, it has many, many, many uses. You can do a quick Google search to find out, you know, what you can use the apple cider vinegar for. But I love it, I really do. Let's see what else we have.